it won't completely prevent you from doing it though. We still have free will. So we right. still have free will. Mm -hmm. So grace doesn't necessarily keep us from sinning. So if we're honest, no one can say that we always have the right thoughts, always have the right heart, always had the right motive, and always had the right actions. So although we're always, the Holy Spirit always empowers us to act morally, so we always have the power to do it, but sometimes we're not inclined to do it. So we have the power to do it, but we're not always inclined to do it. So sometimes we make a conscious decision not to obey the Holy Spirit. So the Holy Spirit will always tell us, don't do it, don't do it. Right. <laughs> but we don't necessarily always listen. Right. Mm -hmm. So we have to choose how to respond with mm -hmm. the grace we've been given. So, the, so God, grace saves us from the consequences of sin, but it doesn't force us to stop sinning. So it's not like, oh, now that I'm a Christian, I'm not going to ever sin, and you know, I'm, you know, I, I'm, I'm just mm -hmm. free from sin. It's like it has, it's a conscious decision. So first, well, oh, like, like some, like well, for me, I was trying to think of the situation. But some people really want something that's sinful, you know, the thing that they want, even even uh, an addict or something. Mm -hmm. But God will take the taste mm -hmm. of that away from you, I, and you won't even mm -hmm. want it. That's how I feel about cigarettes and alcohol because mm -hmm. I used Amen. to smoke and drink I every mean. day. I've done every drug you could think of, but now I don't even, I'm like, no temptation, no, I just don't yeah. even want it. Right. And yeah. I've just we'll left it all. And that's, and that's a blessing. God. So a lot of times he will take, <laughs> completely take it away. Like you just yes. said, like exactly. Cigarettes alone, psh, I don't right. even yeah. want it near me. Mm -hmm. and, and you can boast about it in regards to mm -hmm. what God has done. Not something that you're doing. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. It's something strange. Like God, yes. That's your testimony. Yes. Yeah. Lord, I took this yeah. away yeah. from me. I don't even awesome. have a taste for it. Yeah. Yeah. And it's like my whole life, 50, at least 15 years, cigarettes every day. Oh, yeah. I'm, I'm yeah. like so far yeah. gone from it. It's you're like, free. Yeah. 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 It's like right. a new person. And that's, yeah, yeah, good. He said that's your testimony. So when people are like, well, hey, what is, you know, what what's so good about this Jesus? What's so good? Mm. And then it's, it's like, well, you know, I can't explain all of this. So you say, but what I can tell you is that mm -hmm. I used to do this, yeah. but now that I used to do this way, and now right. I'm that. Yes. So I was telling her, I want to be the example. I want to be the change that I want to see, or the example of. I want to lead the example well, of the you change. If God is in you. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Amen. Mm -hmm. So let's see. First Corinthians, fifteen ten. Says. But by grace, I am what I am. And his grace towards me did not prove vain. But I labored even more than all of them. Yet not I, but the grace of God in me. Mm. So this is an interesting statement of Paul. Mm -hmm. So Paul says, uh, he says, everything I accomplished, it was done through grace. So he said, I'm giving God all the credit. Right. But then in the next breath, he says, but I worked harder than all of them. And who's all of them? It's probably the other disciples. <laughs> it's like, but then he says, but it was God's grace that let me do it. It's like, wait a minute, Dal. <laughs> was it you? Was it God? And so that's the, that's the balancing act is that, so God's grace will allow us to do it, but we also need to, to follow the lead and we need to put forth effort. And so, so Paul, he, he was able to accomplish great things because of the grace of God, because he was empowered with gifts from God. Yet he also states that he worked harder than the rest of them. Mm. So his decision to work hard played a part in the accomplishment. So he had free will to, or whether to follow the Holy Spirit or not. And so, and so we can see that with uh, an example. Is, uh, so he has a shirt on, go to state. So an example of that would be Steph Curry. So Steph Curry, some people may say, oh, of course he's a talent, you know, he's going to be a superstar, you know, mm -hmm. he got all this talent, he can shoot, you know, he's just, he's, you know, of course he's going to be rich and that famous, but yet Steph Curry, in college, he woke up at 6 a.m. every day, you know, went to the gym, then after the gym, he went to basketball practice, and he, and he keeps himself disciplined where his weight does, his weight stays between 193 and 195 pounds. Right. Like he keeps his weight exactly there because that's where he plays best. Right. And wow. so he that's like so he he keeps he works harder <laughs> and he's super disciplined. Yeah. Maybe his father. <laughs> well, no, his yeah, trainer. Yeah. But so yeah, but that's good, 
But that's what you'll find with all of the mm -hmm. so-called natural athletes with the natural mm -hmm. ability. Yeah, right. Most of the superstars, yeah, right. they're working harder yeah. than yeah. the rest of the team. Yeah. So it's not. So yeah, they have all the talent, but then they also have to work hard at but it. But God's well. yoke is easy, though. It's actually yes. easier yeah. to do anything mm -hmm. with Him. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 Light. You said the key word with him. With yeah. him. Yeah. I'm always yes. tempted to try mm -hmm. to fix. Matter of fact, for years yes. I would try to fix things on my own. I said, okay, I won't. I don't. Uh, I won't even buy that. And, mm -hmm. and I and just you recently too. I start. What you have to do is ask God to partner with Him. God, yes. help me. Right. You got to yes. ask Him for yes. the help, yes. and He yes. will do it. Yes. yes. Yeah. And so that's. Yeah. So that's exactly it. So it's. So you have two. So we have the situation where, and that was actually in my notes, where it will cure you of, God will immediately cure you of, or get you rid of the taste of alcohol, rid of the taste and of cigarettes. He said so some people, some that, people he will immediately do yeah, that. Right. Just, or like for just, with yeah. me, when he gave me, told me to teach, he gave me the hunger to study the word and the hunger mm -hmm. to do it. So, so the yoke was easy. So it's like God gave it to you easy. But then there are other situations where, he didn't completely take something away from you. And so you have to ask him to partner with if you. It's his, if it's his will. No, it's his, oh, will, yeah. it's his will. But yeah. but he doesn't always give it's you give the grace right? in yeah. that area. He doesn't always give you the grace in everything. Well, the, ti the timing is what I meant. Is oh, that, oh. That he may not want it for you today, but oh, right. in his time. Right, um, right. And so yeah. and we know so, I mean, some things, that we, we know he wants us to do it. He wants me to stop this, but I still want to do it. Well, a lot of times it's Can real be. times, but then there's some times yeah. where it needs to exactly. work out yeah. in you. So it's kind of like a lot of times people will say, oh, you know, my, if, I, if I only had, you know, another $100,000 or if I only had this and, you know, all my problems will be gone. But then if you look at people that win mm -hmm. the lottery, yeah. was it 99, 95% of them? Are broke again in five yeah. years. They win millions of dollars and they're broke again. And and although they they were it's a so they set of problems. They t yeah. Well, the it's example really with the lottery though is is um was more talking about how you know someone got it done immediately and they didn't appreciate it. Mm. Right. So sometimes if God takes yeah. something away from That's you immediately, whereas if versus someone else may need to work, work on it yeah. and and they still realizes God's grace but they need they may need to work on it in order to have it stay off of them if they get it done immediately it may have been too easy and they, they may turn back so it depends on the depends on the uh, hard work the I think is a virtue and if you work hard to build your wealth it, it, it gives you certain wisdom but if you get you expect your wealth to come from the luck of the draw well, well not wealth exactly. but we're talking about more um just grace in anything, whether it's yeah. taking away your urge for alcohol or okay. urge for yeah. women. So it's yeah. like if you have to work, sometimes God will take it away. Sometimes you have to oh, work for okay. it. Yeah. 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 And yeah. sometimes, so it's, uh, I yeah. didn't appreciate it when I won this money and I was, I drank a little and I, and I was just at that same oh. feeling. And then mm. ever like weeks went by and just because I have a job, I work every day and now I'm just comfortable, you know, now mm. I got my money saved up and I'm just well, comfortable with yeah. money. Ah. And perfect. That's a perfect example. Yeah. Yeah. Sometimes exactly. if God does it too quick, you right. may, you may, you may, realize you may not. He yeah. literally made yeah. me realize and it's just like crazy. All right. So let's see. So we aren't just learning new behaviors. We're being transformed through the Holy Spirit. So the Holy Spirit is changing us gradually each day. Mm -hmm. um, so we can fight against the Spirit or be in agreement with it, to walk with it.